All right, folks, what we're going to see today is if this Arnold 15 inch universal universal replacement lawnmower tire will fit this Cub Cadet. Now, I Googled, I Googled Cub Cadet replacement tires, and these aftermarket deals are about the only thing I could find. But, if you'll look at this, it appears if I got it on there, it's a good inch and a half taller. Which is going to mess with your cut a little bit, I would think, but you know what? If it fits, I really don't care. If it bothers me, I'll just go get another replacement. Because to be honest with you, what comes on these... They're not automobile grade, so uh, and that goes with any brand, so it's no big loss, especially after a couple right, of years. Here we are again. Just used a simple automotive jack to uh, get the tire off the ground here, and be careful what you use a jack on as far as what you put it up against. By far the sturdiest thing I could find under there that would hold any weight was the actual the uh, axle thing itself there. And it seemed to be doing fine. Now, uh, one thing interesting, you take this little cap off. I thought I was going to be finding a screw. And it's a cotter pin. Just bent over cotter pin. And at first you think, well, boy, that's cheap, you know. But when you think about it, it makes sense because bolts come loose. And then it's in the kind of thing you'd look at all the time. So it works, but anyway, I'm just gonna, I don't have an, pardon the traffic, I don't have an official Cub Cadet cotter pin bender, but I do have needle nose pliers, so I'll be back with you okay. on a side note. The cotter pin, it's a little hard to get off. I will say that. And this adapter, like many universal products, or I'm sorry, this tire, like many universal products, um, comes with a baffling array of adapters and what this is doing say is it's gonna one has to fit your tire one has to fit the axle well it has instructions for everything but a cub cadet but I think I've found the right one so Let's see. Okay. Be sure it's on there as far as it can go. Spacer. Whatever that is. And then the cotter pin. Okay, there we go. Stupid cotter pin back in. Rubber cosmetic thingy on. Ta da! Okay. Looks the same to me. Must have been the weight on the other tire, but certainly close enough. I'm not going to worry about it. Excellent. I'd say the hardest part about that uh, Arnold Universal tire was getting the cotter pin off the old one. So, there you go. Aired up and everything.